Every winter, Jewish families gather to light a branched candelabra called a menorah. For eight nights, they celebrate their families and celebrate their faith. The holiday is called Hanukkah, also known as the Festival of Lights. When we think of Hanukkah, we think of the menorah. Its eight flames burn in testament to a glorious victory that took place over 2,000 years ago. Around 200 BC, the Jewish people in Jerusalem were living under Egyptian rule, though they remained largely free to work and worship in accordance with their customs. Then, in 175 BC, Antiochus IV Epiphanes ascended to the Syrian throne, invaded Egypt, and desecrated Jerusalem. In an attempt to assimilate the Judean people, Antiochus forced them to worship Greek gods and outlawed Judaism, banning all Jewish rituals upon threat of death. The ultimate insult came in 168 BC, when Antiochus seized the Jewish holy temple in Jerusalem and dedicated it to the worship of Greek god Zeus. For a Jewish high priest named Mattathias, it was time to take a stand. Together with his five sons, Mattathias sparked a revolt, pitting the desperate Jewish faithful against vastly superior Syrian armies. The battle raged for three years. Against improbable odds, the Jewish uprising, led by Mattathias' son, Judah Maccabee, emerged victorious. Judah Maccabee and his small army of soldiers recaptured Jerusalem in 165 BC and liberated the Holy Temple. According to the Talmud, the Jewish high priests eagerly prepared to light the ceremonial menorah, the eternal flame which would rededicate the desecrated temple to the glory of God. But they found that the Syrians had defiled all but a small flask of oil. It was enough to light the menorah, but for a single night. Hours turned to days, and miraculously, the menorah burned on until eight nights had passed and more oil could be produced. It was time for Hanukkah, Hebrew for dedication. Against all odds, the menorah had not been extinguished, and so the flames of the branched menorah are a potent symbol of the Jews' indomitable faith. The menorah holds nine candles, with the center candle used to light one candle on each of the eight nights of Hanukkah. During Hanukkah, children play a game with a dreidel, a four-sided spinning top with a Hebrew character on each of its faces. It is thought that the dreidel began during the reign of King Antiochus, when Jews secretly gathered to study the Torah. If soldiers arrived, the Jews could pretend to be gambling. Jewish adults also give small sums of money, or gelt, to children during the holiday. And though not traditionally a holiday for gifts, Hanukkah's proximity to Christmas on the calendar has made it customary to exchange gifts on one or all of the eight nights. For Jews around the world, Hanukkah is a time to reflect on the strength and spiritual resolve of the Jewish people. It is a celebration of triumph over religious persecution and of a miracle that kept a menorah lit for eight nights.